Carroll Hard fought three points that day. <coughs> yeah, certainly, Phil. It, it was. Weren't pretty at times. The, the pitch is certainly not made for, for decent football at the minute, if, I, if I'm being brutally honest. But we, the boys dragged out, grinded it out, an important three points for us. It's different ways to win, like you said last year, and that was very different to other games you've won, like Plymouth. This one you had to really dig in. We did, yeah. Uh, Morecambe kept fighting. They're, they're, in the, they're the bottom of the league. They're not going to roll over. They never do. Derek Adams' teams, and like I said, it wasn't a classic. It was it was tough to get the ball down and play on a, on a very heavy heavy pitch that's uh, not 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 in its best nick. But we keep we keep working away. We don't use that as an excuse. So we. We know we we got to do better at times with the ball and use the ball better. But for me, it's, it's about grinding out those those three points. I know you'd said an illness and injury had affected you prior to the game, and uh, it shows even more that they've come through a game like it that. It is, it is, and uh, we have got a lot of that in the in the camp at the minute. But I think uh, I think most clubs will be suffering from that a bit. You know, whether it's COVID, co- uh, cold, and flu knocking about. So we have to we have to adapt. But the boys that started the game and then the boys that came on. Uh, did themselves justice and, and got the important three points. Fine margins as well. They hit the post at one end, you go up the other end and score. Could have been different, hey, really, hey, couldn't hey, it? Hey, yeah, if my auntie had it, she'd be my uncle, wouldn't she? So, listen, sometimes that happens. Uh, it's a great finish by Gav. I thought he was excellent, outstanding today, Gav. And it's, it's, it's about the win for us today. We had to, we had to respond. Performance, yeah, we're not going, getting carried away with that, but the, the three points are a huge boost and, and puts us in the top ten. Was that Gav's best game in a Vale shirt, do you reckon, so far? No, he's done really well. I think everyone remembers the last game, so you, you come off a pitch, you're, you're a fan, Phil, you come off and go, that was his best game, but he's, he's putting some good performances for the course of this season, but he was uh, he was certainly outstanding today. And seeing the game out as well, which in, in games like that is really important, isn't it? Well, it's a clean sheet. Uh, it's, without the free-flowing football, you've got you to get clean sheet, you got to... To, to win the game, I always thought it'd be a mistake or a bit of quality that, that won the match today in a, in a game with limited chances. But uh, I'm sure our fans go home happy. You know, not necessarily a great performance to watch, but they go happy that we we, we pick up the points. On to the next one now. See out 2022 at Sheffield Wednesday. Yeah, it is. It is, and that's great. They're the challenges we look forward to all the time. But uh, this was this was an important three points for today. Now we look forward to a, a great trip to Hillsborough. Cheers, Daryl. Thank, Thank you. you. Tom. Well, obviously, as you say, you wanted a response and you got it. Maybe not fully for own football, but you got the result. And that's the one, isn't it? it it is, it is, and nobody remembers the results in six, seven games' time and six, seven years' time. It's, it's about winning football matches. Uh, yes, we have to be better. Yes, we have to improve in all areas, but it's, it's, it's a good win and uh, stops the rot. But it gives you that bounce to go into this game at uh, Hillsborough, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah, which will be a totally different game. Slick pitch, a lot better pitch, I'd imagine. Uh, different game, so we prepare ourselves as best we possibly can, hopefully get less illness in the camp as well and uh, see how we go. Thanks, Thank you.